Hello everyone. Welcome to 29th exercise of Autodesk Fusion 360 Beginners tutorial. In this exercise, I am going to show you exactly how to design this figure using Autodesk Fusion 360. Here are the dimensions of the figure and the tools and commands I am going to use in this tutorial. If you are new to this channel, do subscribe to us and turn on the bell notification so that you won't miss any of our new videos. Now without wasting time, let's get into it. First of all, create a new design by going to file, select new design. The unit I am going to use in this tutorial is millimeter. You can change it by clicking here. Create a new sketch on the front plane. Go to center dia circle. Select the center as the origin and give it a dia of 24 millimeter. Followed by a concentric circle of diameter 50 millimeter. Press enter. Go to two point rectangle. Select the first point anywhere here and give it a dimension of 20 by 80 millimeter square. Press D to go to sketch dimension command. Select the center and this side of the rectangle. Provide a horizontal distance in between them 40 millimeter. Select this side and the origin and give a vertical distance of 20 millimeter. Go to trim. Trim out this unnecessary portion. Go to straight line command. Select the first point on this corner and the second point on this circle. Make sure while selecting the point on the circle, this tangent icon appears so that this line will be tangent with this circle. Follow the same process on the other side. Here comes the tangent option. So click here. Go to trim again. Trim out this unnecessary portion. Go to fillet. Click on this corner and provide a fillet distance of or fillet radius of 7 mm. Select on the opposite corner. Press enter. Here is our design ready. So finish sketch. Go to extrude command. Select this upper profile. Drag it backward up to a total distance of 120 mm. Press enter. Turn on the visibility of previous sketch by going here. Go to extrude again. Select this profile. Extrude it up to 7 mm. Operation join. Click OK. Create a new sketch on this surface. Under create, go to project or you can directly press P to project. Selection filter specified entities and make sure that projection link is turned on. 
select this figure and click OK. So, this figure has been projected on our current sketch. Hide the bodies so that you can have a clear view of the sketch. Go to two point rectangle, select the first point here, provide it a dimension of 12 by 40 millimeter square. Go to fillet, click on this corner and provide a fillet radius of 6 mm. Press enter. Finish sketch. Go to extrude again. Select this profile. Drag it backward. Click on this surface so that the profile will be extruded up to this surface. Make sure the operation is selected as cut and click OK. Select this surface and create a hole on it. Drag this hole here. Give it a diameter of 16 millimeter. Drill point flat. Extend all. So that the hole will be created throughout the whole body. For the reference, Select this outer line and provide a distance of 23 millimeter. Select it again and provide a distance of 23 millimeter. For reference to, select this line and provide a distance of 60 millimeter it looks okay so click okay now i'm going to pattern this hole throughout the whole body so under create go to pattern rectangular pattern object type Features and for the object, select this hole. For access, select this y axis or the green axis. In this direction, give it a distance of 34 millimeter and number of quantities 2. In this direction, total distance 40 millimeter, number of quantities 2. Compute option adjust, click OK. Select this surface and create a sketch on it. Draw a vertical line from the origin. Give it a length of 40 millimeter. Under create, go to spline and fit point spline. Select the first point here and the second point here. OK. Now, 
make sure this line is vertical this control line is vertical sorry horizontal and this control line is vertical press d to go to sketch dimension command select these two point and provide a length of 5 mm select these two point provide a length of 12 mm and these two points provide a horizontal distance of 22.5 mm draw a straight line from this point to this point ok finish sketch under create go to revolve select this profile and for the axis select this line extend type full operation cut click ok here you can see we have cut this portion so in order to prevent this go to previous sketch right click on it and edit sketch reduce this dimension to 20 millimeter finish sketch now you can see this cut has gone our design is ready press a to go to appearance I am going to apply red color on it. If you want, you can double click on it and change the color. Increase the roughness and decrease the reflectance. Done. And if you want to apply some color on this surface, click on faces and apply a color on it. That's it. Thank you everyone for watching this tutorial. I hope you guys have learned something new in this tutorial. See you in the next one. Till then, keep designing and design whatever you love. Bye bye.